Hello students, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to discuss about important problem types in design and analysis of algorithm. We all know algorithm. It is nothing but step by step process to solve one specific problem. So here the design and analysis of algorithm is not restricted to a specific problem type. So we can apply these algorithms to any type of problem regardless of its complexity and also whether it is in computer field or in any other field okay so these are the some of the important problem types the first one is sorting searching string processing combinatorial problems graph problems geometric problems numerical problems so for these type of problems we can apply algorithms the first one is sorting so sorting is done by using step by step process for example if the if you want to sort the numbers five numbers so first we need to compare the first number with all other numbers and second number with all three numbers and the third number with all two numbers like that so we need to follow step by step process to sort the numbers so sorting is nothing but arranging a set of data or arranging numbers in some order either in ascending order or in descending order smallest to the largest or largest to to smallest so in our daily life we can see many applications using data in sorted order as telephone directory so in telephone directory all the numbers in sorted order and also in the merit list and also student roll number and hall ticket numbers etc so those are all in ascending order right so there are different methods to sort the data so that can be divided by using two categories the first one is internal sorting and the second one is external sorting so if internal sorting is nothing but if the data is to be stored in a main memory that is known as internal store sorting if the data is stored in the secondary storage devices like pen drives hard disk like that so that is known as secondary storage secondary i mean external sorting okay so some of the examples of sorting algorithms are we can use bubble sort algorithm so these are all algorithms for sorting we can apply bubble sort algorithm merge sort radix sort insertion sort quick sort selection sort heap sort so we'll discuss, uh, i will discuss all these in the coming classes okay so we can solve sorting problems by using algorithms this type of algorithms the next one is searching searching is nothing but finding a number or a list of entries okay searching refers to finding for an item in any list of entries so it is one of the common operation in data processing for example if you want to search uh, any organization if you want to search for one particular employee so that comes under searching finding okay searching an employee details from the database or searching telephone number from the telephone directory okay so these are some um, real life examples so we can search an item by using these type of algorithms linear search algorithm hash search breadth first search binary search and depth first search so these are all searching algorithm for searching we can use this type of algorithms then third one is string processing so we all know string string is nothing but collection of characters so those characters may be letters numbers or special symbols okay special symbols so some of the examples of string processing algorithms for example if you want to search for one word in a given paragraph okay and also replacing all instances of one word for example i want to change uh, uh, in the place of a i want to change it to yes so like that replacing all instances of one word with another text file next counting the number of occurrences of a particular character so in this character how many a's are there so there are two how many c's are there there are two like that so counting the number of occurrences so for these type of problems we use algorithms and the fourth one is combinatorial problems so these these are the problems the task explicitly or implicitly to find 
कॉम्बिनेशनल ऑब्जेक्ट लाइक परमिटेशन सो नंबर ऑफ कॉम्बिनेशन और सबसेट दट सेटिस्फाई सटाइन कंस्टेंट्स फॉर एग्जाम्पल इफ वी फिट ऑस ए कॉइन फाइव टाइम्स सो हाउ मेनी कॉम्बिनेशन हाउ मेनी कॉम्बिनेशन आर अकर्ड सो लाइक दैट and also the traveling salesman problems and shortest path problem identifying all possibilities of subset for example if the subset contain uh, set contain 3 3 three values so set contain 1 2 3 so next we need to find out the number of combinations so how many number of combinations so we can uh, from 1 2 3 we can form 1 2 फॉर Uh, it, the graph problems involves analyzing and manipulating graphs which are mathematical structures containing nodes we all know graphs are nothing but number of uh, vertices and edges okay so collection of vertices and edges are known as graph so here are some of the examples of graph problems shortest path problem minimum spanning tree graph coloring for these type of problems we use algorithms so i will discuss what is shortest path problem minimum spanning tree mst and graph coloring in the later classes next classes okay and the sixth one is geometric problems so geometric algorithms deal with geometric objects such as points lines polygons okay and also these are used in computer graphics robotics and tomography so in this type of fields the geometric algorithms are used so these are the examples convex hull problem convex hull problem so in convex hull problem uh, given a set of points in a plane find the smallest convex polygon that contains all points so and so this problem is uh, this problem is commonly used in computer graphics okay and the next one is nearest neighbor problem so in a given set of points in a plane find the closest point to a given query point so this type of problems for this type of problems are known as nearest neighbor problem okay yes and the last one is numerical problem so in numerical problem it involves mathematical equations system of equations computing define integrals evaluating functionings and so okay so the majority of such mathematical problems can be solved only approximately not exactly some of the numerical problems are finding root of equations performing matrix operations and solving different equations so these are the some of examples of problem types so total 7 sorting searching string processing combinatorial problems and graph problems geometric problems and numerical problems so i hope it is clear if you have any doubts regarding to this video please comment me in the comment section for more videos please do subscribe my channel thank you